Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen, dear colleagues. Uh, welcome to session E3 220, the treated breast, what you need to know. My name is Michael Fuchsjäger. I'm from Graz, Austria, uh, and I have the pleasure uh, to talk a little bit about imaging after treatment of breast cancer. Um, this is somehow considered the stepchild in breast imaging. Nobody really loves it. We all have to deal with it. It's sometimes very tricky, but nevertheless, uh, there are some, some basic things uh, to obey, and if you do this, I think it will be easy uh, to somehow um, tackle this, this topic. Uh, what you might not know is that we are here kind of a dummy session. Uh, we are the, the first session this year um, of the interactive teaching program, um, meaning uh, that you will be able to vote. So the first slide, actually, is to test the system. Question one, which country won the 2010 FIFA uh, World Championship? So who is a uh, football world champion? Uh, fortunately, it's a European country, but which one? Is it A, Spain, B, Germany, C, France, D, Italy, or E, Austria? So who is current world champion? A, Spain, B, Germany, C, France, D, Italy, E, Austria. Kindly vote now. I hope we will get the results soon. Everybody voted. Wow. Okay. It's not not so bad, or is it bad? Well, actually, it's correct. Spain is world champion and got uh, uh, most, most of the votes. Uh, so you're somehow interested in, in, in football. Well, I put uh, um, Austria there. Austria wasn't even at the world championship. I'm, I'm, I'm sorry. Can you please, uh, technical support, bring the slide up again uh, for, for connection uh, with the iPads and mobile devices? Uh, we have further questions later on. Uh, so Germany, France, and Italy were qualified but didn't make it, and Austria wasn't even qualified for the World Championship. Anyhow, uh, when we are talking of evaluation of the breast after treatment, um, we're talking about um, uh, changes after treatment with uh, breast-conserving therapy, radiation therapy. Uh, but we're also uh, talking about uh, patients who get reconstructions with autologous tissue flaps like tremor deep. I will be talking about these uh, guys, uh, but also reconstruction with implants or lipofilling. This is in italics because uh, next speaker, uh, Dr. Julia Herre Camps Herrero, will talk uh, about this. So when we do both therapy imaging, we want to confirm lesion removal. We want to identify post-procedural fluid collections. Of course, we want to detect residual or recurrent cancer. We are screening for metagronous cancers, and when we are doing all this, uh, we try to be low uh, with false negative interventions, as we always try to be, especially uh, in screening mammography as well. So what you can see here, for instance, are uh, expected findings. You can see signal voids. Uh, in this uh, MRI of the breast after surgery uh, due to surgical clips. In breast-conserving therapy, changes are, of course, due to surgery.